Charlotte or, or Miss England? Whichever you prefer, Charlotte aka Miss England. All oh, right. Is that what people call you? Occasionally, no, just Charlotte normally. <laughs> Do you get Miss England more than Charlotte nowadays? Or? Only if they don't know my name. But I don't mind. I'm only Miss England for a year, so I've got to cling on to it for as long as possible. <laughs> okay. Uh, how did you get the title of Miss England, I guess, is the first question. It took a while. Um, I did the competition for three years. Obviously, didn't win the first two. Um, and the third year, third time lucky. Raised a load of money for charity. Um, there's lots of elements, and I could bore you with them all. But there's a lot more to it than you'd think. So it was weeks in the making. It took a lot of preparation, but it got there eventually. Had a really good time on the final night and won, which is a bonus. So, Brilliant. How many other people were in the running? So there are 60 girls in the final every year. Um, obviously, they have to win a regional heat to get to the final. So I won Miss Devon. And in the Devon heat last year, I think there were about 20 girls. So obviously, if you imagine 20, at least 20 girls in each regional heat, there's 60 regional heats. That's a lot of girls to go through. Brilliant. So you've done Devon proud. Yes, I believe I have. Big up the Southwest. Indeed. And here you are at uh, uh, Torquay United. Um, Wearing how, blue. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> uh, how did this come about? I'm not quite sure. I just woke up this morning and thought, do you know what? <laughs> Let's go to watch Torquay play. There's a match on. Um, no. Everyone in the local community has been really supportive. Obviously, the final for Miss England is going to be here next year in Devon. Um, so I'm trying to get out to as many sort of local areas as possible, the football club being a big part of the local community, and um, just promote it, I guess, and support the local guys. I mean, it's I, I like sport anyway, I love football, so it's good to come down, and I'm wearing Lucky Blue. Hopefully they'll win. Prediction for the score? South End nil, Torquay mm, two. Two, that's good. I'm gonna go, Three points. Yeah, I'm going to go two. Then. And uh, obviously you were born and raised in, in Plymouth. Mm -hmm which is uh, local to here, so you know the area quite well. I know relatively well. I mean, yeah, I went brought up in Plymouth, went to school in Plymouth, uh, moved back to London about four years ago, but my heart's here. I love the southwest. It's a beautiful part of the country. I like coming back whenever I can, um, so it's great to come back down here because I'm so busy with Miss England and stuff. I'm normally up in London or up north, um, so it's nice to come back. You just had a meal here at number 10, so you enjoy that? Of course. It's really good, actually. I might going to have some more. Dean dragged me away halfway through my roast, so I'm a bit annoyed. But there's half a plate left, so I'll go and, go and finish it off in a minute. <laughs> Brilliant. Well, thank you very much. And, uh, yeah, hopefully your scoreline comes through. I really hope so. Thank you, and good luck, boys.